I got an email on the 28th of March from Kareem. The subject line was, Ayman, welcome to the Send Money Club. So I was intrigued and I opened it. And I'm sure Kareem's open email, open rates on this particular email was higher than, uh, than usual. So I let the email sleep for, for a few days. And then over the weekend, um, early in the morning, I was at home and my son was asking about his Arabic homework. And I wasn't in, a, you know, I was in the mood of doing that uh, early morning uh, activity. So I got a push notification from Karim's app saying, uh, add your bank account to uh, Karim Pay. And I was intrigued because one, it gets me out of unnecessary early morning homework. And two, more importantly, is that in the Emirates, uh, having peer-to-peer uh, uh, -peer payments from one person to the other is uh, tightly regulated to avoid uh, money laundering. There are security concerns, privacy concerns. So there's a full infrastructure here to protect the users. So when you have a peer-to-peer -peer payment via Karim, and you can be able to add it via the, uh, via the app and get paid via your bank account. I was very intrigued to see how they did that. In this video, you'll see how simple it is to use Karim Pay. All you need to do is, to, uh, is, is have somebody else's mobile number. Because usually, let's say, I want to send you money via, uh, via, uh, uh, via bank transfer. I'd have to ask you for your bank information. You have to dig it up and send it to me. You will send it. Uh, uh, either in full or missing. Let's say I add it to my bank's interface. I'm going to have to wait another six hours or so. So there's a security precaution until uh, uh, once I add it before I'm authorized to send money to it. And then I send money through it. So it's a long process for me to do so. Now, simply with a mobile number, all of this process can be a bypass. I'll show you how. Sending and receiving payments via Kareem Pay in the Emirates has become a very viable payment method due to the ability to transfer money directly into your UAE bank account. So from the Karim app to your bank account using only your mobile phone number. Let's see how this works. Within the Karim app, what's being referred to as a super app, there's a Karim Pay tab. When you click on it, you have the payment options that you have. Let's see how sending money works. So let's say I want to send uh, out 20 dirhams to my wife with a note. Alright, so the add photo and add gif in case I need to send out a receipt or an equivalent. So next here, you choose the recipient. That's from your address book. What I like about this is it shows you in green those who already have a Kareem account. So any Kareem account, whether it's for the taxi or the food or the payment. So you select the recipient. So what happens here is it asks you, how do you want to pay for this? You can pay for this using your existing cards within Kareem. Or if you already have Kareem credit, somebody paid you or you have credit there, you can, you can select that as well. So here I'm saying transfer with pay. All right, so my wife just received a notification via the Kareem app and an SMS message. That was done instantly. Let's open up the Kareem app and see. All right, so it confirms the receipt. It confirms uh, my cheesy message. And then let's say you receive 20 dirhams. So she has the option of transferring to her bank account or topping up the Kareem credit. It's interesting that the bank account top up has an incentive of receiving uh, 15 dirhams extra with the option of adding, adding a bank account. So what happens now, she would add her full name and IBAN and so on to add the bank account. Or she can simply say, top up my Kareem credit. Once topped up, you will no longer be able to transfer the funds to your bank account. I'm sure that will change later on where you can transfer money fluidly. All right. So what happens is I also get a notification from my side that, that the payment was successful. There's a payment receipt with a transaction ID, obviously. Look at my Kareem pay in my transactions here. I can see this. It's complete. Now let's try something else. Let me try requesting money. And then I want to transfer it to my bank account. So let's say I've asked for 40 dirhams. All right, so my wife received a transfer request notification. Ayman has requested 40 dirhams for <laughs> emoji. So she has the option to decline or send. Let's say she sends. And then there's the payment option here where you can select whether from your card or from a Karim credit if you have enough credit. Then you transfer with Karim Pay. Instantly, I get a notification that I was paid the money. I've received the money of 40 dirhams. All right, so let's say I received 40 dirhams. I'm going to choose transfer to the, to the bank account. <laughs> Done within one working day, and I'll likely receive a text message from my bank when uh, this is received. Very smooth.